before I even think about doing the pull up. We're back here again, guys. Five minutes in. You don't come down for these seven minutes. You focus on your breathing and learn how to stabilize it. You don't argue with your girlfriend. Don't be disrespectful to her. Don't be disrespectful to your mother, your father, your family, or your friends. Go somewhere by yourself, look around, and then release yourself in only the positive way. You ready? In three, two, one. How you doing guys? Welcome to Broly Games. Thank you for liking. Remember to smash that subscribe button. Thank everybody for supporting. I got a good workout for you guys today. I don't have a pull-up bar. I'm out here in Colombia. There is no gyms. So I gotta do what I have to do. Groundwork, you already know. And this is how you get and maintain a six-pack app. Groundwork. Let's go. I got a time off. I call this a seven minutes of hell. Cause go through it. So I'm gonna put the timer down there and we're gonna start in five, four, three, two, one. First thing, five push-ups. One, two, three, four, five. Plank. You're gonna plank and hold for at least 30 seconds. While you plank, you don't wanna put your back down. You wanna keep your butt up and sink in your core, contracting it and allowing your abs to feel, to get engaged, you know? Because then the next couple of exercises is gonna really mess it up. <laughs> Nine, 30 now, we go to the side. We're going to, we're going to activate the, the right side of the abdomen, the obliques. You know, you gotta make sure that you structure and sculpt each side. You wanna work with the balance to make sure each side, because the body is not naturally symmetry, you don't have that natural symmetry, so you have to create that by working out in these ways, doing calisthenics. Focus on your breathing. I like to stretch my arms out, stretching this side. Then we go to the other side. Notice how my eyes contract, and this left side is a little bit different than my right side. I'm actually working on um, structuring my left obliques to be a, a, a mirror image of my right side. Once your abs are engaged after those 90 seconds of ab work, then you do another five push-ups. And then it resets. Oh, 30 seconds. One, slow. Two. Three. Four. Five. Now we back down. This time, Knees to the elbows. Until it hits two minutes. We're back up. First set, you chill. Now, move a little bit. Engaging your abs in different ways. We're at two minutes. At 30 seconds, we switch. Do the same thing to the next side. You don't come down for these seven minutes. You focus on your breathing and learn how to stabilize it. This is like being on the rings, but you're on the ground. As you can see, I have to balance myself in order to complete this exercise, or this motion, I should say. So, you hope your stabilizing muscles get activated. Doesn't matter what number, you just keep going. You gotta take your time, take your time. Three minutes. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Stay there, just hold. So that 30 seconds, then you switch. Boom, 
shoulders is feeling crazy, arms is already activated, forearms are engaged, core is feeling stupid, my legs are engaged. You almost call this a full body workout. Now get into a mental stage. You will shake, you will tremble, but do not fall. <laughs> That's the key. Five, four, three, two. Uh. And five push-ups. You wanna do your five push-ups in 30 seconds. You wanna try to make it slow. You're gonna hit four minutes and 30 seconds, then do the five. Normally I'll do this exercise going up to starting off at seven minutes when I begin, but as my body get used to it, the weeks go and go, uh, go on, I'm more consistent. I'm doing up to 10 to 15 minutes. Before I even think about doing the pull-up, before I sit down and do hella reps, I do groundwork like this. Four. Five. Ah. Back here again, guys. Five minutes in. He's killed. Three, two, one, let's go. Ah, see, so swimming bullets. Let's go. Ah. Ah. Hit the door. Get back there. I know it feel crazy. But that's the pain, the weakness leaving your body. We almost done. Gotta finish strong though. Two, one. Sometimes staying in a plank position. So crazy and so underrated, people don't understand how much muscles you get engaged. One, two, three, four, five. Ah. As you can see, I'm drenched in sweat. I've activated my chakra in so many different ways, and I'm ready for the day, for war, for anything. But guys, please, just because you're ready for anything doesn't mean you must release that negative energy on anyone. Release it in a positive way. Don't argue with your girlfriend. Don't be disrespectful to her. Don't be disrespectful to your mother, your father, your family, or your friends. Go somewhere by yourself, Look around and then release yourself in only the positive way. You ready? In three, two, one. Ah! Let's go. <laughs> Thank you, bro. Woo! Yeah, <laughs> you rock, man. You're natural. <laughs> Oh, I told you.